This is a typical uh, floor lamp. I think this one we originally might have come from Ikea or actually another source. Uh, these floor lamps often have a big weight under here, of course, and uh, often it's a, it's a plastic type weight. It might be full of some concrete or some other heavy material. And they often degrade and break, and ours did too. And what I did for a solution and was basically to, to get quick reet. So you can get some quick reet. It's a quick reet concrete, quick concrete mix. Get the quick reet that has vinyl in it. And just get a small, small container. It's probably no more than 10 pounds. You probably only need about half of it. And basically you can pour into the lamp base uh, a very, 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 very solid fitting. I just used some cardboard here to keep a channel for the uh, the actual wire that comes out of the lamp. And then of course I, I took off the old plug at first when I had uh, moved some wiring and checked a few things. Uh, just put a new plug on it if you need to. But basically I'm just going to trim away uh, the cardboard, pull out as much as I can now, and then we'll just cover this you can either just get felt sticky pads or you can buy just some felt that you can just uh, glue or tack onto here in the whole bottom. This is a much better base now. It's, it's more flush and level with the actual metal base. It sets better on the floor. It's not as rocky as the original. And this is much heavier. This is much heavier. There's probably a good solid five pounds in there. So it makes for a much more stable light. So don't throw the lamp away. Just get some quick reet from Home Depot and you're good to go.